Are you tired of your boring old solid background? Yeah, me too. Well, stick around because in this video, I'm gonna show you how to set a custom background using a screenshot. Welcome back everybody, my name is Wayne. Thank you so much for being here. And if this is your first time here, I make videos just like this one to simplify your gaming experience. All right guys, and so if you are wanting to personalize your Xbox, there is no greater place to start than right here at your home screen. And so in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to set a custom background using a screenshot from one of your favorite games or a moment in one of your games. Before we actually go into a game, let's go ahead and talk about real quick how you can capture a screenshot if you are using the new Xbox Series X consoles and or controller. You will be able to use the new share button right here that's on the controller. It's the middle one between the, um, I don't know, I guess you can call it the menu button and the customize button. And so all you need to do is tap that button once real quick and that'll take the screenshot for you. All right, and so now that I'm into my game and I wanna make a capture of this particular screen, all I need to do is tap that button as we said. And once we do that, as you can see there, it shows a screenshot was saved. So now that we have the screenshot saved, let's go ahead and close out of the game here and go back to our home screen. And we're going to go back into customize. And so real quick, there are two different ways to get to um, how to set your background. So the first thing we're going to do in the first way is click the customize option, which is right here. And then we'll go over to your my color and background. And then from my color and background, you're going to go to the middle column and then down to screenshot. So once you're in screenshot, you need to search for your screenshot that you took. So, so we're going to click into that screenshot. Then the next thing you'll want to do is just kind of hit your directional paths because you'll need to bring up this menu option here, go down to more actions and then set as background. Background. Select that option and then you'll go back to your home screen and voila, there you go. Your home screen is set up as the screenshot that you use from your game. Okay, and as I mentioned, there are actually two ways of doing that. So the first way we did it with the customize button, which is going to be the fastest way of getting to your uh, custom background settings. But if for some reason you've forgotten that and you can't remember and you're kind of old school and you remember to hit your guide button, you can hit the guide button, then go over to your settings and then from settings, you'll stay on general and then you wanna go over to personalization and then down to my color and background and then you can go to your middle column and then into your screenshots again. So as you can see, that's a few more steps, but there is two ways of doing it. Just in case you don't remember the one, you always had the backup way of doing that. Okay, great. And so now you should have a pretty awesome personalized home screen that fits your uh, personality and your desires for your home screen. And as you notice, it's a pretty easy process, so hopefully you guys will take advantage of that. And if you did like this tip, then make sure you check out the video that comes up next on the screen, and I will see you and the next one.